Teenage rebellion. Everyone goes through it. From Nirvana's grunge to Lana Del Rey's trip with bikers, every teenager has dreams of being different and changing this world. Whether those changes are for good or bad doesn't matter, as long as there's an impact. Every teenager feels the need to be different, be a rebel, change what's around them. Rebel is somebody who like doesn't go with the flow of society or with the people around them. They, you know, they literally rebel, or they're just different. They don't um, go with what everyone else does. Basic teenage stereotypes would probably just be lazy or stupid in some cases. A lot of teenagers get a bad reputation because a lot of times because there's a few bad ones and then they kind of just ruin it for everyone else. But um, also like some teenagers can be really sassy and they think that they know everything. And they don't know everything, but they do know some stuff, okay. Uh, when I think of a teenager, I think of a still developing adult. Uh, someone who's still trying to figure out who they want to be and what kind of world they want to be in. A lot of people such as myself, don't want to be part of a big group. I like to be independent. Why? Being independent to me is really important because I can do me and not worry about anything else. I don't really care about what people think of me, so I just do my own thing. Um, I, I don't consider this generation of kids as a whole to be rebellious. I think every generation has its rebels. Um, in terms of this generation, I think there is a struggle to figure out who they are culturally. It seems that they are given things that are reappropriated from past generations, but they don't seem to have anything of their own yet. Oh, we have rebels. Oh. Graffiti artists, um, like gangsters, you could be rebels. Anyone that doesn't follow the rules, I kind of would consider a rebel. X Generation, all born between the years of 1966 and 1988. Their coming of age truly hit in the 1990s. They're the ones who gave us Nirvana and other artists such as Banksy and national icons such as Obama. Y Generation, those who were born 1994 to 2006. Their coming of age was truly in the 2000s. They produced icons such as Justin Bieber, Miley Cyrus, and Malala Yousafzai. X Generation commonly looks down upon Y Generation, saying that Y Generation is lesser because they have less rebels, less icons, and don't make as much as an impact. Y is probably thought of as worse than Generation X just because they've seen our worst parts because we don't really have times or opportunities to be as good as them yet because we're not old enough. Um, I think the difference between Generation X and Generation Y is Generation X kind of knew, or at least they had an idea of where they were going. We knew that we wanted to kind of get rid of the corporate 80s music and movies and that's what led to grunge rock and to movies by like Miramax, like Pulp Fiction, stuff like that. Generation Y, I think, is still trying to figure out what they want. Generation Y, which is us, um, I think we're just a bit misguided right now. Um, we've gone through like the phase where like, oh, we, you know, we look up to these Generation X people and we still do, but it, it was just like, something that came and went and we kind of go back to it or you know so nowadays there's like everyone's trying to be different so there's like pop music and all those kind of things and like you know it's it's different from what was generation x because that was you know it's already been done and now people are trying to be different I think it's a matter of perspective, and when you try to compare to say which one is better, they've both contributed um, important things to our world. So to say one is better than the other is kind of like saying 
trying to think of a good analogy here. It's kind of like saying carbon is better than oxygen. You need them both. Um, you know, because the X generation kind of defines who we are. Because without the X generation, we wouldn't be here. But the Y generation also is what is pushing us forward. Yeah, yeah. Yeah.